I'm not recording this video for show. <clears throat> As you can see, I didn't put any lip gloss on. I didn't, I didn't come. Oh, Jesus. How you know I'm going to stay? I just feel like um, I should. I should put this video out there. I was just in the public salon and there was a lady in line two two people ahead of me and I was looking at her and she looked amazing she looked so good she looks stunning like when I say this lady was beautiful and I mean down to her diamond earrings the diamond ring on her finger her hair was flawless and I must add she was a Caucasian lady she was she was beautiful dressed to kill and I looked at her and I was on my way out and the Lord said, go and compliment her. And I went up to her and I said, ma'am, I just want you to know that as I was standing in the line, I noticed you. And I want you to know that you look stunning. You are so beautiful. You look amazing. And I am blessed to be graced with your presence. And that woman grabbed my hand and she said, Oh, you know what I'm about to say? She said to me, On this day, 29 weeks ago, I lost my husband. And I feel like a ton of bricks has fallen on me she said but i want you to know that that means so much to me with you taking the time out to come and tell me that i look good because i don't feel good but i thank you and when i got to my car i just broke down because You never know what someone is going through. And, you know, even myself, I feel so unappreciated by my children. I feel like they take me for granted. I feel like people are very inconsiderate of me. And, um, but I continue to hold on to God's unchanging hand and know that he will see me through i'm sorry but i didn't want this this video to be i wanted it to be what it is and um i just want to know from i want you to know that uh people notice you who who should i have ever seen Ooh, yeah, that I will say. Thank you, God. And for those that are carrying so much weight or during this time of the holiday season, you have people that are no longer in your lives, such as that woman. You know, she just lost her husband. And, um, you know, this is a season that my mother definitely love but this isn't even about me it just arrested me the holy spirit arrested me and i just began to just say forgive me god for complaining because though they mistreat me and though they take me for granted i love my children and i love you know being able to help people but sometimes people really take you for granted. And I am learning each and every day that people treat you the way 
you teach them to treat you. I know I kind of throw that off, but if you you have to teach people how to treat you, because if not, they will treat you however they choose. You have to have zero tolerance for people taking advantage of you. But I just wanted to to really lead this because I felt like it was so. Oh my God! Like God just. It was a blessing. I had no clue what that lady was going through or what was on her mind. But um, if I could title this, it would be, um, I don't know. <laughs> I just guess it's an emotional moment. God bless you.